All right, and here in this next set, we've got Cash Jar Man versus PCS Driftwood. I'm not quite familiar with Driftwood. But as you can see, he is a Greninja player here to make his uh, mark on the world. Let's we'll see how it goes. Oh, how we shall see. Keeping complete, and Driftwood loses his second stock. Castman's on game point. Let's see how it goes. Ooh, 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 ooh. Let's see it. These two characters are so fast. They're just running circles around each other. You love to see it. Two characters, not with really big gimmicks, but a lot of speed. A lot, a lot, a lot of speed to spare. Oh, with the forward air. The deceptively slow Greninja forward air. Oh, he's scheming. Oh, he's scheming. Oh, look at him go. Platform pressure, but no such luck. Caster Man's on the ground doing back airs. Two shadow sneaks. Gets on stage. I do talk about how... This game is jump simulated and everyone just kind of jumps all over the place. But honestly speaking, Greninja is one of the characters who kind of likes, likes to keep his feet firmly planted on the ground. You like to see dash attacks come out, stay on the ground so he can do some short hop or full hop aerials. Not exactly a character you see jumping around too often. Is that it? Oh my god. Not yet. Not yet. The party's just begun. Oh, that's it. Okay, Gasterman takes game one. Very good performance from Driftwood, though. Very most a righteous game one. You miss Redacted's forward airs. Yes, Redacted did have quite the quite the way with uh, forward air and air pressure. That's for sure. Just gonna say redacted. Let's just move on to a different point of conversation. But still, I'll say Driftwood's gameplay and movement is quite handsome. To be sure. Stop the battle. Ninja. Two. These two look like they're about to pass out. You can see the focus, the determination in their eyes. The will to win, to succeed. Okay, it goes. Cats about getting some of those classic Pichu combos going. He's no Pikachu, but Pichu can still string together quite impressive combos in this game. Drifo gets away from the Pichu down smash ledge trap. And yes, fully agreed that Greninja's dash attack is nutty. It is one of the finest dash attacks in the game. Reads the landing, Driftwood. Casterman comes back on stage with Skull Bash, and it works out too. Very nice. Oh, oh! Look at these two. They're both hungry for blood right now. Casterman takes it with a back air. Super effective. There's the forward air. It doesn't kill. This is Pichu we're talking about, and it still didn't kill. Narrowly avoiding some. Some potentially dangerous Pichu edge guards thrown off the stage. Oh, oh, oh! What an edge guard. That combo is out of control. Dash attack up smash. 
at zero, it's just like, wow, this just works. Oh, is that it? Yeah, that's a kill. Can't be double jumping over the ledge against Pichu. It's too dangerous. Ledged in. One frame window for that, and he found it. And here we are, Caster Man's on last stock. Driftwood's got a shot here. Caster Man. He's an advantage. It's Pichu with advantage. There's the down. Is that really? Oh my god. That wasn't even close. He just straight up exploded. Caster Man takes it. 2 0. Great, great, great performance. Look at this edge guard. He knew that Caster Man was going to go super low and was just like, all right, I'll go down there too, son. I'm Greninja. I've got an infinite recovery, sort of. Greninja's recovery is very largely sized. Bye. Oof. He had a shot here, but unfortunately he walked in and got nailed by that last... Look at that. The last hit and just the last hit. That's crazy. Well, great set anyway. The next setup will be Vivi versus Steven. Should be fun.